Hello everybody again. So this time we're doing science. Question four, question two about balanced diet. We are going to find out what a balanced diet is and why we need a balanced diet. Draw a bar chart of food groups. Think of a scientific question to investigate and plan the investigation. Choose and use equipment correctly for an investigation. Collect and record results. Write a conclusion from our results. Getting started. Write a food diary for the foods you ate each at each meal yesterday and today. Include any snacks you had. Which foods did you eat most of? How many fruits and vegetables did you eat? Did you eat any foods you think are not so healthy? Share your answers with a partner. What is a balanced diet? Our diet is all the food that we eat. We need a balanced diet to stay healthy. This means we must eat the right kinds of food and the right amount of food. To have a, bio, a balanced diet, we need to eat food from all the different food groups. The picture shows the different food groups and how much we should eat of each group. So the key words are balanced diet, carbohydrates, diet, fat, fiber, minerals, proteins, vitamins, fats, oils, and sugar store energy, but too much can be harmful. Protein makes our bodies and build our bodies and make us grow. Carbohydrates give us energy. Fruits and vegetables contain vitamins and minerals that keep us healthy. Good and bad carbohydrates. We need carbohydrates to give our bodies energy, but not all car carbohydrates are good for us. Sugar is a carbohydrate. M many foods we like, such as cakes, candy, and koa, contain a lot of sugar. Too much sugar is not healthy for our bodies. The carbohydrates found in white bread and white rice are also not as healthy as the carbohydrates in whole wheat bread and brown white rice. Questions Look at the picture of the different food groups on the previous page. Name one food from each group that you like to eat. Which food groups should we eat most of? Which food groups should we eat least of? Which food group builds our muscles and helps us to grow? Suggest a healthy suggest a healthy school snack that contains a food from three of the food groups. Water and fiber. A balanced diet also includes water and fiber. We need water because it has important functions in our bodies. Substances are carried around the body dissolved in water, including water in the blood and other body fluids. We need water for body processes, such as digestion. Water in sweat cools you down. Wastes are passed out of your body in water. Fiber comes from plants. Your body cannot completely digest most types of fiber. Eating fiber helps to help helps to help food helps to help food to pass easily through the digestive system. Foods that contain lots of fiber are vegetables, fruits, beans, lentils, brown rice, and whole wheat bread. Vitamins and minerals. Vitamins and minerals are substances found in the foods we eat. Vitamins and minerals help your body to function properly and stay healthy. Some foods have more vitamins and minerals than others. Fresh foods such as fruits, vegetables, fish, and meat contain lots of vitamins and minerals. 
Calcium and iron are examples of minerals. Calcium makes our bones and teeth strong. We need iron to make our blood healthy. Sodium is a mineral found in salt. Too much salt can be unhealthy for us. Activity. Talk about balanced diets. Work with a partner. Make a list of the foods you usually eat in a day. Talk about these questions. Which food group or groups does each food contain? Are there foods from each food group in your list? Does any of the food in your list contain fiber? How much water do you drink each day? Do you think your diet is balanced? How am I doing? How well do you understand what makes a balanced diet? Choose one of these answers. I understand as well. I understand most of this. I do not understand this yet. Think like a scientist one. Draw a bar chart of food groups. Zara wants to eat noodles for lunch. She looks at the label on a packet of instant noodles. Draw a bar chart of the different food groups in the noodles. Do you think that instant noodles are a balanced meal for Zara? Say why or why not. Think like a scientist too. This is a question to investigate. Starch is a carbohydrate. You have found out that starch makes iodine solution change color from yellow brown to blue black. Think of a question about foods you can investigate using this knowledge. Plan how you would find the answer to your question. Which type of scientific inquiry would be best? Which variable would you, will you observe or measure? What is this type of variable called? Which variable would you keep the same? What is this type of variable called? Which variable would you change? What is this type of variable called? Choose the materials you will use. Decide how you will record and present your results. Carry out the investigation and write a conclusion from your results. How has this topic helped me to know if my diet is balanced? Which food groups should I eat more of? Which food groups should I eat less of? Look what I can do. I can say what a balanced diet is and why we need a balanced diet. I can draw a bar chart of food groups. I can ask a scientific question to investigate and plan the investigation. I can choose and use equipment correctly for an investigation. I can collect and record results. I can write a conclusion from my results. So, see you, see you later in the next video when we are going to do the project about vitamins. Bye!